the consequences of not properly citing sources. It is a significant academic integrity violation to fail to credit any sources, whether they were written, oral, or electronic. Failure to do so may result in a plagiarism charge, which is characterized as the use of any material, whether published or unregistered, without due credit or other indications of academic misconduct. Any action that unfairly influences the assessment of a student's academic achievement or success qualifies as academic fraud. When someone cites a source, they are indicating that they used another author's words, concepts, figures, or pictures inside the text itself. Citations are an easy method to recognize a published work specifically. They are gathered in article and book databases as well as in bibliographies, reference lists, and other places. Citations are made up of essential components and include all the details required to locate and identify publications. Depending on what has been mentioned and whatever style was used to construct them, citations may seem different. The reliability of the research and the author's reputation is undermined if a writer produces the article without providing sufficient citations to earlier studies, implying to the reader that they are unfamiliar with the literature on the subject. Most educational institutions see plagiarism, the claiming of credit for one's own work, as cheating if someone takes someone else's concepts, results, or research without referencing them. Fallacious quotes or paraphrases of previously available material that deceive readers regarding the assertions of the cited source are examples of inaccurate references. Readers may find the sources a person utilized by using a direct quotation. Citations to different sources aid readers in learning more about a subject. A key component of learning and understanding is being able to find and use resources that support the study or give various interpretations of the studied subject.